Hey, yo, peace. What's up, y'all? This is your big homie, Big Mike, checking in. Real Talk TV. All right, man. First things first, I hope y'all having a great day out there. And if you're not having a great day, hey, man, peace and blessings to you. Keep your head up. Keep pushing. Keep striving. Tough times do not last forever, but tough people do, all right? So just want to throw a little bit of love and motivation y'all way this morning, all right? Keep going, all right? But anyway, I'm going to get right into it, guys. I am going to uh, speak on a video suggestion that I got from General Bullseye in my last video. And General Bullseye, thank you so much, man, for your continued support. You've been rocking with me for a little while now when I had like way under a thousand subs. So thank you again for your support. I really do appreciate you, man. Peace and blessings. Uh, General Bullseye, just paraphrasing a bit, he uh, he said that he usually uh, realizes a person's true colors after they've done him dirty and how to identify a person's true colors before it's too late. And the answer to that is simple. Um, you watch their actions, you listen to their words that come out of their mouth. What's in the heart cannot be hidden forever, trust me. What's in the person's heart, whether it's love or whether it's positive, or whether it's negative, it will manifest itself in some point in time. Believe me when I tell you that. I found this out from people in my family. I found this out from my former best friend who has something in his heart against me for whatever reason. I don't know, honestly, but I don't care about that no more. That's that's in the past. But he said something to me that eventually uh, led me to know that this dude got something in his heart against me and I had to go my separate ways. And th that's that. But um, what's in the heart cannot be hidden. The, the Bible says that what's in the man's heart, his mouth speaks. So you got to listen to what people say to you and do not take this whole, oh, I was just joking crap too lightly. People ain't joking with you when they say the same things over and over and over. One time, you might can let that slide, but keep your eyes on them. Keep your eyes on them. When people say something to make you look at them sideways, Mike can, Mike can let it slide depending on what they said, but keep your eyes on them. If they say something to make you look at them like, Hmm, I wonder what that was about, right? But when when you get somebody to say something to you that doesn't sound too friendly, or it sounds like they're filled with envy, trust me, they are. Or when someone does something that leaves you feeling twisted, believe me, they got something in the heart against you. We all know what love looks like. We all know what love looks like. If you are getting the exact opposite of that, that tells you everything you need to know. And a lot of times we are reluctant to act on when, uh, act uh, on people when we hear these things and see these things because of who they might be to us or how long we may have known them. When I'm telling you to get your feelings out of it, get your feelings out of it and take it for what it is. When you procure success, you know what support looks like and what love looks like when someone's genuinely happy for you. You know what it looks like. They're probably more excited than you are. But when they're standing by quiet as if they have nothing positive to say about your accomplishment, come on, man. Y'all know what it is. We all know what jealousy looks like. Because think about it. Would you... Would you act the same way if they would have done something positive or if they got something that they were happy about? You know what I'm saying? A good job, a new job, a new car, a new home, a new relationship. If that happened for them, would you be happy for them? So the same, the same behavior that you would display, you would want in return. So when you don't see these things, take it for what it's worth. Don't take these things too lightly. And when you see these things, when you, like I said, when you see these things early, or no matter when it is, you can see it later on down the road, whenever. As I said already, the heart does not lie, man. <laughs> Everything that's in a person's heart will eventually manifest itself at some point in time. Just give it time. If a person loves you, They'll display that through their actions, not just with their words. Me personally, I'm not a big fan of words. Not anymore. I've had many people in my life that said things, but their actions said otherwise. I always watch the actions. 
The words is nice. Don't get me wrong. It's nice to hear somebody say, I love you. I support you. I'm your BFF for life or whatever the hell. But when the actions does not uh, reflect that, I don't need to ask any questions. I already know what it is. When I stumble across, when I stumble across something positive, or you know, or I I procure another level of success, or something good happens for me, I know what support looks like. I know what genuine happiness looks like. When I don't see that, it tells me everything I need to know. Period. So use your common sense. And when you see these things and hear these things, know what it is. You don't got to ask any questions. We all know, like I said, what love and support and genuine happiness looks like. When you see something otherwise, get the hell out of Dodge. Because none of us wants to be around anybody who has any resentment in their heart towards us. Genuine hatred in their heart towards us. Who wants to be around that? Who wants to be around that? It's only going to affect you. It's going to poison your spirit, your peace. So don't surround yourself with anybody like that, man. Get the hell out of Dodge. You know what I'm saying? If uh, they're not showing you the support you need or the love you need, and they're displaying that not only by what they say, but by their actions. Watch them. Watch their actions. They cannot hide what's in here forever. They can't. They will, <laughs> they will reveal themselves at some point. Just be watchful. All right? But anyway, man, that's all I got for this video. Thank you again, General Bullseye, for your suggestion. I really do appreciate you, man. Thank you for your continued support. And thank each and every one of you for watching. I really do appreciate each and every one of y'all as well. But until next video, your big homie, Big Mike, checking out, man. Y'all be blessed. Take care.